Um, and of course, uh, we'll see how uh, Sergeant Hawk does this time around. It's going to be a lot tougher than previously. Um, so what we're going to be seeing from Marsh is really going to be just him baiting out his opponent to... Ten Masters. Mitch, please. Please. Okay. Uh, what I was trying to say is that there that's what we're talking about right there. Um, so a lot of what a lot of what Marsh is going to do is he's going to be really focused on baiting out his opponents. Uh, he'll do it with focus. Sometimes he'll do it with a grab. Uh, but what that will allow him to uh, pull off is just a series of chains into... Ooh, nice. Okay. Um, he was looking for the shore. You can did not get it. Sergeant Hawk is going to be taking the first stock. And that's going to be a stock for Marsh. Does get the punish. And we're back to even. Um, so... But right now, um, Sergeant Hawk got a really good opportunity to get a... That means a lot to me. Hey, I gotta help. Um, and so, really, what we're gonna be... There we go. Um, so now, I think we've... Uh, that was a really good chain right there. And a punish. Uh, March is gonna take the second stock. It seems like he's got this a lot better figured out than he did before. Um, just took him a bit of time. That's not always... You're not always prepared for the sort of like... Ah, that's going to be a... Ooh, almost. Not quite. Uh, but definitely uh, doing the job pretty well. All right. Uh, Arson. Given a bit of leverage for Sergeant Hawk, but it may not necessarily matter. Oh... Uh-oh. Uh, we don't like to see that happen. Marsha uh, trying to go for some swag. Gonna take it in a JV2. Alright. We're not gonna see Lyle out or Battlefield on the table. And so... Arsh definitely proving that he is one of the best in the Upper Peninsula, if not the best right now. Pretty commanding, as far as I'm concerned. We'll see, what is Sergeant Hawk going to do? What changes will he make to uh, get a bit of a better uh, chance against this, uh, against Marsh? Because even though it... It's really tough, and Marsh plays very methodically in a way that is he's very quickly able to figure out like what his opponents are going to go out for. But right, I guess the bigger question is going to be, what is Sergeant Hawk going to do in response? How is he going to uh, apply himself this time? I guess a big thing about playing against Ken is that you have to respect really the neutral that he's able to pull off. And then also uh, realize that he can pull out that punish setup anytime that he uh, deems it. See right there, he does read the roll, but he does not get the full combo out of it. Um, that was that was an interesting setup. I'm not sure what he was going for there, uh, but we do have, and it's not even going to matter that Sergeant Hogg had uh, arson because he does lose that first stock. Uh, Marsh developing a very, very concrete lead in uh, this uh, second game. <coughs> Ooh, that was uh, a bit gutsy. Okay, so he's propping up a bit of damage. Does wait out the focus a little bit. Not this time. So, um, uh-oh, that's going to be a stock for sure. All right, yeah. And that's where he'll get you. Marsh is really, really works off of just, like, he just will, if he sees that you're used to one thing that he's pulling out against you, he'll just, um, he'll psych you out and then go for, like, a successful uh, focus attack. Um... So right now, he's 
got a pretty good lead. All he needs to do is get one more punish set up. Doesn't quite get it there. He's looking for the three stock. I know that much. Um, that was definitely a bit of a read. Ooh! Jumps up, and he's going to take the stock. Commanding, commanding three stock by Marsh. He's going to take the set. 